Yo, what's going on guys? It's Retonic here and today I'm actually going to be showing you guys how to increase your monitor's refresh rate. Now, I know that a lot of you guys play on like 60 hertz, 75 hertz monitors and unfortunately that's almost at the same level as like playing on console. So if you are a PC player, this is a way that you can actually increase your monitor's refresh rate to higher than it is by default. So let's say you have a 60 hertz monitor, you can probably get it up to around 75. You have a 70 hertz monitor, you can probably get up to around 90, 95 maybe. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to do that. Hope you guys enjoy. If you do, make sure to drop a like. Let's get into it. So first thing you wanna do is you're gonna need an NVIDIA control panel. Now I do believe AMD has some version of this, but I, I honestly, I don't have an AMD graphics card, so I have no clue how that's gonna work. But if you do have an NVIDIA graphics card, then here you go, I'm gonna show you guys how to do it right now. So once you guys have an NVIDIA control panel open, you're gonna to want to go to change resolution. Now, once you guys go to change resolution, you're gonna to wanna to go to customize. As you guys can see, I have a 165 hertz monitor. That is what my monitor is by default. So that is no overclock or anything like that. Um, so you wanna to go to customize. You wanna just select a random, whatever your refresh rate is and whatever your current desktop resolution is. I'm just gonna click on this one just cause it's just a random one I have on here. Now, what you're gonna wanna do is you literally just wanna change refresh rate hertz, or change this, and I would just up it by five each time. I would go five at the beginning, so I'm gonna go to 170, and then you just wanna click test. Now, once you click test, the monitor should just go black for a second, and then it should pop back up. And if it pops back up, then you're okay. And you can hit no. And once you hit no, it'll revert back to normal. And then you can go up by five more. So now I'll go to 75 and then you can click test. And if you test it, it comes back up. You're good. Hit no. And then you want to go back and you're going to do this over and over and over. And I'm actually going to test my limits right now. I'm going to go ahead and go to 180 test. And at some point it will not pop back up and it will just be black and it will go back in 15 seconds as you can see because it's reverting back to in 12 seconds. So if it, your screen goes black then you know you're good you don't go any farther than that. Now I'm actually curious so I'm just going to go to, I'm going to jump up by 10. I'm going to go to 190 because I'm really just curious on what the limits of this monitor are. And see now my PC or my uh, monitor just said signal out of range and by that means that means that it will not go that high. So I'm going to guess that mine is 185. I'm just going to double check that because it will revert back to normal um, in a second. There we go. Back to normal. So I'm going to go ahead and go to 185 and just click test. I'm going to guess that's probably the max since I have 165. Oh, actually 180 is the max. So it says signal out of range. So I'm just going to wait until it pops back up and then we'll know that we're good. So now that my monitor has came back up, I know that I can't go as high as 185, so I'm going to go with 180 as my max. Now this is where it comes down to your guys' choice. Now I'm going to tell you right now that by going way too high with this refresh rate can lower the lifespan of your monitor. So I will tell you that if you find your max, do not, and I repeat, in all caps, do not leave it at your max and play on that. You will ruin your monitor. So if you go and you find your max for me, mine is 180 and I have a 165 hertz monitor. So that is 15 more than I would normally be playing on. So I'm going to decrease it now down to 175. Now that is a reasonable amount and it will not hurt your monitor at all. And if you want to be even safer, you can even just go to 170 
which is only five more but the help is help so if you guys want to do that it does help you it gives you way more um refresh rate in game too so it's nice if it was a lot smoother than normal and especially it's going to make a huge difference going from like a 60 hertz monitor to a 75 hertz monitor it's going to make a pretty big difference so i hope you guys do enjoy the video i'm going to go ahead and just hit test just to show you guys again test and it will pop back up and say everything's okay and i'm just going to click yes And then after you click yes, now it should show this up here and you can hit okay. And now if I click on the same res right here, now it says refresh rate 170. Now I have that option. And then you just wanna click that and then you'll click apply. Now that is not my resolution, so I'm not gonna use it, but you would do it with your default res and then you hit apply and then you're good. That's all you have to do. And now when you go into game, you're gonna have that refresh rate. So I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Hope it helps you out. Remember, stay safe with your monitors. Don't go too high. And uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one. Make sure you drop a like for part two and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.